Nah, shit ain't nothing, huh? Chilling, man. I'm glad to be up here. It cooled off, too. I heard y'all had it hot. I just left Louisiana, though, boy. Like, it'd be hot as hell in the South. Nigga, it was so hot down there, I saw a Greyhound bus and a dog was on the inside. <laughs> oh, fuck a roof. His ass needs some air conditioning. White people up front, how y'all doing? Y'all just charge y'all shit on the credit card, didn't you? Yeah, we're gonna go to the show, we'll charge it. We waiting on checks like a motherfucker. Hold on, nigga, Friday. I'm gonna go Friday, and then third. Nigga, y'all wait Thursday, then I'll go. Give me $10 now, nigga, and I'll just go and give it back to you. They didn't hear y'all came, got y'all seats set down too, cause they ain't want no trouble. The anyway, white people, they know we'll come and sit in their damn seats. Y'all know us, boy, we'll come in, nigga, and just sit down, nigga. <laughs> as soon as the usher come, you be like, nigga, don't even look over there, dog. Nigga, don't even look, nigga. Oh, yeah. Excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me, I'm sorry, play. That's true though, man, because white people hope things don't happen. They do, they hope things don't go wrong, they have high hopes. Just hope things don't go wrong. Running late like, oh my God, we're running late. Oh my goodness, I hope nobody's in our chairs. Oh my God, I hope nobody's in our seats. Let's get the ushers. Bros don't never get the usher because we don't hope, we wish. Black people don't hope about nothing, we wish. We wish a motherfucker would be in our shit. <laughs> Bruh come in late like, nigga, I wish a motherfucker would be in my damn chair. Much money I had to pay for these seats, nigga. Yeah, four and five, partner. Four and five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all out here too, Philly, little man here. Brother Sharp, clean on the front row, got the matching socks. Boy, nigga, clean, look at your boy. That nigga over here, first day of school, clean up in this motherfucker. <laughs> Brother Johnson is wearing a lovely shirt and tie that don't go together. Man, I just realized this about me the other day. I don't know what y'all been going through, but you know, I just realized this about me, partner, is uh, I'm a grown ass man. You ever realize you can't do something no more and you just really gotta go, nigga, I'm a grown ass man, I can't do that. My little cousin, he's 17, 18 years old, trying to get me to play full court basketball, partner. Full court, up, down, back up, up, jump, run, up. Nigga, I'm a grown ass man, dog. I've been hurt my whole left side out there trying to do that shit. I, I got shit to do tomorrow, man. I ain't got time for that. Sex, I can't really do it like I used to. I used to can go. I, I still got a few skills, but nigga, I used to can do it all night. Now it takes me all night to do it. I just ain't got the, ain't got the stamina I used to have. It just. You know, you're a grown ass man, it's little shit you don't do no more. Like, like, you know, we got a lot of nicknames. Y'all know black folk, we got them nicknames. You be hearing them shout out on the radio, we gonna give it up to my little pot in the stomach ache. Uh, start a kid, nug nug, runway. I met this brother the other day, brother named Daryl. Brother named Daryl, partner. He gonna tell me, everybody call him delicious. Time I said, you can call me delicious. <laughs> I'm a grown ass man, dog. Angry call no another dude delicious. What if he way down the street or something? Delicious! Nigga, hold up. Damn delicious. Man, that's why I don't like a lot of this music out here too. I'm a grown ass man. I can't do it. I like a lot of these songs, man. What up, boo? I like I like these songs. I like I like these songs like that. Them old songs make you feel something. You know, song make a thug cry. That's why thugs don't like Prince that much, because he had that Purple Rain song out. Thug can't handle that one right there. 
right at the end, Prince said, <laughs> nigga, thug beat. <laughs> no, nigga, I'm cool. I'm cool. Nigga. Songs like Family Reunion by the OJs. Come on, that one right there, boy. Me, you being just got out of jail. It's so nice to see all the family. Nigga, you be up there crying, think about Big Mama. Big Mama! Big Mama! Let me go, Harold. I cry if I feel like it. Them old singers like Teddy P tell you what they want in a song. Teddy tell you what he want in a song. Teddy, turn off the lights. Light a candle. And Teddy think you ain't listening to him, he'll holler at your ass. Tell you, turn him off. <laughs> I know you make sure that damn light out. I know that. You ain't ready. Teddy grown ass man. You ain't gonna be messing around here. I don't like a lot of these little songs out though. Like these new little dudes, they whine too much for me. I don't like these little dudes, man. They whining. I can do it in the shower. I will take, I'll take you there. I can do it anywhere. I'm a grown ass man, partner. I don't need nobody crying for me like that. Don't cry. Don't cry. Get in the shower. Let's do it. That's how you do it. You don't have to whine about that. She want to get in there. Go on, let's go. <laughs> and the women, y'all taking over. Y'all songs are just going off. Nigga, y'all songs, this little, this little bill song, come on now. You can pay my bill, pay my telephone bill, pay my automobile. <laughs> I'm a grown ass man. I got my own damn bills. You pay your shit. I got time for that. I ain't got time. Didn't nobody say nothing when you was using the phone in my house. Didn't nobody say nothing. That little song, Scrubs, come on now. That, they're just messing up carpooling. That ain't right. <laughs> Hanging on the passenger side of your best friend, Ryan. I'm on my way to work. You don't know me. I drove last week. You don't know me. I drove last week. You don't know. Live at home with your mama. My mama's sick. You don't know what I'm going through. I got problems. You don't, I don't appreciate it. I don't appreciate it. <laughs> they say that's the woman anthem, though. Y'all get an anthem, you know. Women get an anthem song, yeah, hey, yeah, about why man ain't treating them right. Fellas, we don't never get no anthem. Our only recourse is to wait for Luke to come out with a song. Get the, the chicken booty, come on, get it. I know it always make me feel better. Y'all get an anthem, no. Ever since, ain't nothing going on but the rent. You know, that started it all. Ain't nothing going on but the rent. You got to have a J-O-B if you... Oh, damn. Uh, my bad, dog. My bad. I trip. I trip. My bad. Last year, it was Tyrone. Brother got to call Tyrone. I don't even know Tyrone like that. And I like the song till she got all sassy. You know, that what made me mad, dog. You know, she, tell him, come on, help you pack your shit. <laughs> Look here, I'm a grown ass man, Eric. I paid the cable, I paid the cable. Well, I ain't going nowhere till the end of the month then, shit. I ain't going no damn well. Tyrone don't have to be over here till the 30th. You ain't, you ain't getting ready to watch HBO on me. I, 
I bet y'all don't go nowhere. I bet y'all don't go nowhere. I bet y'all. <laughs> now, music blowing up too, boy. Black music is everywhere. It's blowing up R&B all over the place. I was like, I had a chance to go to France. So I went over there in April, went to Paris. They was kicking like all black R&B. It was a little late, but they were kicking it. Like R. Kelly, they were rocking R. Kelly, and it was in French. But it still sounded like R. Kelly. He's blowing, too. <laughs> Do shimmy, pill, timmy, clum, and tree tray, boo. Demi bottom, show a ding now. Do shimmy, pill, gimme, clum, and tea tray, boo. Off up in college. What I'm saying is you can't translate off up in college. You just can't. Certain shit you can't translate. Off up in is one of them. Because anytime you off up in some shit, you know, come on now. You know she ain't graduate right there. Off up in college, come on, get your, come on, bring your ass on home, come on. Ain't nobody got money for that. Come on, down there, off up in college. I works too hard, I works too hard. Come on, come on home. Off of in some damn college. <laughs> What's up, baby? It's a trip, man. I was looking at y'all seen a little movie, The Woods. That's nice. That's nice. Like that's like our nice little black film. You know, we don't get a whole bunch of them. We ain't get no. We don't never get movies that turn into ice shows for our kids. Yeah, no, that white movies turn into ice shows. They got Lion King, and then they get Lion King on ice. Aladdin, Aladdin on ice. What we got? Set it off. Booty call, booty call on ice. Don't take the kids. And they got space movies, too. White people love space movies, boy. Love them little space. They had another Star Trek movie. They was out there camping out. You know, 17, 18 days, they spend the night, wait to go. We ain't do that. We don't do movies like that because we got to be at work. We, we ain't got time. We ain't got no off days, be out there waiting on no damn movie. We ain't got time for that. They love space movies, though. You know why? Because they, you know, they like space. You know how they move way out, be trying to leave us. They be moving, <laughs> trying to get way somewhere like we don't know where they at. And our cousin work for UPS and tell us. We'll ante up on the house so they won't be out there by their damn self. Nigga, we out here, we out here now. That way they love space movies because they think they're going to move to the moon and leave us down here. That's the whole philosophy. White folk going to move to the moon, leave us down here on Earth. No, you ain't. Because if y'all move to the moon, damn it, we coming to the moon. We going to be in space shuttles with Cadillac grills, nigga, just... On our way, one headlight out, nigga. Tags all wrong. All base booch. Boo, 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 boo. Uh, boo. They're coming. <laughs> it's real, man. Right on. <laughs> it's a trip, dog. Y'all be going over to Atlanta City? Y'all be gambling? Boy, I don't gamble like that because I seen that one dude leave out of that. Y'all seen that one fake when you ain't gambling lost too damn much? You be seeing that, that dude leave the casino with this one right here? I don't play like that, man. I be trying to win that lottery, though. See, them lotteries be big. They got them big lotteries now and be 190 million. Come on, I be trying to win that, boy. 190 million? Come on, I need that. I know y'all think, come on, say it. I know you got some money, but I ain't got 190 million, though. Because I win, I keep it real, though. Y'all know I be true. I be a true Cadillac type brother. I keep it real. I put most of it in the bank, stocks, bonds, certificates, what have you. 
but let you know I'm true Cadillac type player type dog. I'm gonna have about 36,000 in cash, nigga, just on. <laughs> nigga doing regular everyday life stuff all at the gas station. Uh, let me get a pack of Newports. Uh, give me two more lottery tickets. And give me three. No, go ahead and make it $4 on pump eight. All in a rubber band inside a Crown Royal bag. <laughs> Where it's safe. <laughs> you know, black folk ain't worried about Y2K. We ain't tripping out, boy. We wish the bank would lose our little money down there. We're an Aka Fool. Aka Fool, that's another little thing black folk got that scare white people. Aka Fool. Because they know we can pull that mug out at any given time. I got an Aka Fool gold card, boy. I'll be waiting. Akafu, you know Akafu, you know, like you go in a restaurant, you sit down first, then they sit a little white couple down, then they get their water or something before you. You be red, Akafu, right there. You be like, oh, let, let them get one more goddamn thing before I get some hot swap. Okay, ma'am, we're sorry. We'll be, we'll be right over. I've been trying to play a little golf too now, ever yeah, since Tiger Woods won a couple years ago. Been out there on the golf course now trying to get my little golf on. You know, there's a lot of black people playing too now, you know, ever yeah, since Tiger, I call it the post-Tiger years. A lot of black folks out there on the golf course and uh, Lord, we wrong, we wrong. <laughs> nigga, we out there walking all across the grass and shit, nigga. Brothers out there barbecuing and trying to borrow people golf cart to run to the stove. And Nigga, I'll be back. Ain't like it's your cart, damn. Nigga, it's terrible. But it opened it up, you know. That when you see, you're going to have to have like more blacks all over the sport of golf. You got to have like black golf announcers. You know what I'm saying? That's one reason we really didn't play golf, because you got to be too quiet. You know, they be shushing you and everything. You know, shh, shh. I'm a grown-ass man, partner. You ain't, nigga, tiger my cousin. I can say something. Tiger my cousin. A black golf announcer get too excited, though. See, he wouldn't do it right. He'll start out right, but somewhere in there, he going to get too excited. He couldn't do it the regular way. You know, he'll start out regular. He, Tiger Woods could win it all here on the 18th hole. This putt could take him to nine under par and the win. This very short putt should break a little to the left. God damn, dog! You almost had that motherfucker, man. That shit almost went in there, man. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. We be all over sports, man. We taking over all these little sports now, man. We black folk, we be everywhere now. Downhill skiing. I mean, we gonna take over. Synchronized swimming, water polo, hockey. I don't know about hockey. I don't know if they're gonna let some real bros play hockey. I mean, there's a couple of bros playing now, but I'm just talking about like, like Lil Darrell and, two, you know, Tub Nup them and uh, Water, you know, and Stubby them, all them niggas, I don't know. Cause you get to fight. They actually just let you fight. Come on now. You know, it'd be a brother out there skating without a stick, nigga, just. <laughs> so what, what's, what's, and you know what he's thinking, I wish a motherfucker would. <laughs> you know we don't ice skate real good. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Yeah, the, the, the little man, white folk gone crazy too, man. They out there killing folk. That man shot up all them folk because he lost a hundred thousand dollars. That dude in Atlanta. You know, white people scared to be broke. That one thing, black people, we ain't scared to be damn broke. If they come take all our furniture back, damn it, we make a pallet. Come on, everybody get on the floor, let's sleep together. Tony, get next to your sister, everybody warm up right there. Don't worry about that, damn, we don't need no bed for real. We ain't scared to be broke. And I noticed that too, though. You know, I was just noticing through that situation, though, that wasn't a lot of black people in that, you know, particular set of circumstances. You know, because, you know, we know what? We don't really get killed in large groups. Check your history. Go back. You don't never hear no 17, 18 of us nowhere getting killed all together. Much shit we got to deal with. You don't never hear about no eight, nine of us getting killed all together. We don't go out like that. You know, hold on, boo. Uh, hold, hold on, baby, baby, baby. You know, I'm, you're going to have to calm down. Chill, I, I, I'll hook you up, I'll hook you up in a few minutes. You gotta be all right, yeah. Look at you, you go. go on work it, girl. She just out her damn mind up in this moment. Like she at the house or something. She just walked up here, Brad Grant didn't write something on this for me. She gonna be all right, get her some water or something. Somebody get her a church fan or something, hold her. Oh, holy moan with her. Mm, she gonna be all right. I'll hook you up, boo. <laughs> no, I'm just saying, you know why black folk don't die all together? Because we run. We run when somebody else run. We don't be asking no questions why we running. We don't need no run coordinator to start to run and get it all organized, nigga. If I'm with you and you start running, damn it, I'm gonna start running. That's just how it go. We be in the middle of conversation too, nigga. So anyway, hit nigga. Damn dog, you scared me, boy, nigga. What the? Worldwide, though, man, because people don't go to church like they used to. That's what it is. People don't go to church like they used to, man. I know I ain't been in a while, and I went like two Sundays ago. I went. And you know that's scary when you ain't been to church, and then you go to church because you know what that make you. A visitor. Oh, that's scary. When you a visitor at a black church, that means at some point in time, you might have to stand up and have words. You got to know that little speech. You know, that one lady did it right in front of you. First of all, giving honor to God, pastor members, and friends. You sitting behind her thinking, damn, I don't know none of that shit. All I know is hip hop language. I'm in the middle of the church talking about, uh, first of all, uh, giving big ups to God. Rem, you bout it, bout it. And the choir. They kept on pressuring me. I turned into juvenile on their ass. So you want me to come down the aisle, huh? Oh, you trying to get me to pay my tithes, huh? You want me to get my tithes, huh? You want me to put some money in the basket, huh? You a paper chisel, you got your body on block, lips to the moment you. My mom in the choir stand, sit your ass down. A trip, man. You ever go to church and it be second Sunday? Old folk choir. Keep it real. If you're gonna go to church, that's the only Sunday. If that's the only one you're gonna go, you don't wanna be there on old folk choir. You be on your way in and hear them singing and be like, golly, nigga. Damn, it's an old folk choir. Boy, I wanted to hear going up yonder today. They be in there hitting them hymns, them long drawn out hymns, you know, Sister Johnson and Sister Wilhelmina Green. We're marching Zion, brood of a brood of a Zion. We're marching to Zion. 
Brood of us. I think you be in there trying to stay up. Hey, give me a peppermint or something, nigga. I ain't gonna make it. I ain't gonna make it. I'm telling you, I ain't gonna make it, nigga. I ain't gonna make it. I mean, the old preacher preaching. Oh, nigga, he can go on forever. All the fellas in there thinking, damn, the game on. Your mama in there thinking, I need to put some more water in my greens. Ooh, I know that water and cook down out my greens. Gonna mess my greens up. Go call your daddy and tell him put some more water in my greens. You know he ain't go. He ain't left y'all at the door in his drawers. Go on ahead now. Go on pray for me. Jesus will. Jesus go on, go on here. Go on with your mama. Go on with your mama. There's all kinds of preachers out there too now. Like I've seen on cable, they got like a black faith healer. He an ex-pimp. Got finger waves, you know, got the, got the, got the little rings on every finger. He be wearing a blue shirt, blue suit, blue gaiters, all blue. He be pimped out too. He be he a faith healer. He be healing people. He talk like this right here. How everybody doing? <laughs> How y'all doing? They say, they say this little boy right here. Say this little boy is blind. Say he can't see. Let me see if I can do something for him. Psycho Alpha Disco Beta Bio Aqua Dulu. Get on up, come on there. Can you see me? Am I clear to you? Picture me rolling. Get on out of here, I'm wild. I'm too much. Puffy, hold me down. I'm crazy. They say this lady right here, they say she got diabetes. Say she got sugar. Say her sugar is up. Let me see if I can do something for her. Let me see. Itchy, itchy, ya, 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 ya. Mocha toka, I shall ya, ya. Get on up out of here. Somebody give her a snicker. Not going anywhere for a while? I'm crazy. I'm too much. I'm a kite. Pull me down. I'm too high. I'm wild. <laughs> yeah, rap music it took over everything, though, boy. I love rap music, too. It blew up. Hip hop is everywhere, dog. I can't handle a lot of these people. I like, I like though, I like the fact that it's so true. You can just put whatever you want in there, whatever. Like, like, like that dude Trick Daddy with that song out now. That's just a country ass word. Now, he got a whole song. You don't know now. Keep it real, like me. Wear more polo than I do, girl. Good for you, Trick Daddy. More polo. All righty. The trip though, I can't keep up with all these rappers like Snoop Dogg. That was my cat right there. When Snoop first came out, I, I can understand Snoop because he rapped real slow. I guess it was all the chronic and whatever he had smoked. <laughs> but I understood Snoop because he was my speed. Snoop be blazing. Snoop and one, ten, three and ten of four. <laughs> Snoop Doggy Dogg and Dr. Dre and said that there's out. I was like, yeah, nigga, that's my shit right there. I can handle that. When Bone Thugs and Harmony came out, though, nigga, I knew I was old. I can't keep up with them, man. They rap too damn fast for me, man. I ain't. When they first came out, I thought they were Spanish. I ain't know what the hell was going on. Nigga. I thought it was a new Taco Bell commercial or something. Nigga, just, hey, then give me a burrito, taquito, then give me a little burrito, bring. Then give me the Mexican with some sour cream on the first. Wake up, wake up, wake up. It's the first of the month. I like, nigga, that new Taco Bell commercial, nigga. I likes that. I likes. Ain't no groups no more though, man. All the groups and broke up. Ain't nobody in the group no more, man. Jodeci broke up, you know. All the little groups, man, separated. Drew Hill, one of the dudes left. Ain't nobody together no more, man. What happened to the group? People all that used to be in another group, they with somebody else, and they in flip groups. You got people like LSG, people that don't even go together. 
They don't go together. And I like them too, but in a way, don't they all sound like different animals and insects when you think about it? Ain't Gerald Laverne sound like a grizzly bear? Yeah. <laughs> Keep sweat like a damn mosquito in your ear or something. Yeah. <laughs> My money. <laughs> Nigga, roll your window up, dog. It's some bugs or something getting in here. Johnny Gill smoothed in. He turned into a rock wild on your ass. It's all that growling he got to do at the end of the song. He started out smooth. Yeah. He got me singing, my, 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 my. My mama, 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 my Ain't no groups, man. Groups barely together now, man. In the 80s, we used to have all groups. Boys and men, they the only ones still together. They the only ones, they, they, you know, they chilling. They got, they got their stuff together. We, all the groups left. In the 80s, we had groups, dog. We had Got. We had New Edition. We had Troop. Ready for the World. Cameo. We was together. It was all together. Remember in the 80s, if you was a lead singer in the group, you couldn't even be the lead singer if you didn't know how to do this. <laughs> you couldn't be the lead singer if you ain't. <laughs> Mr. Telephone Man, there's something wrong with my life when I don't want this number. Get kick every day. <laughs> you was true. Spread my wings and fly away to that place that I love for and my arm will <laughs> Nigga, you was junior. And mama used to say, take your time, young man. Mama used to say, don't you rush to get up. Mama used to say, don't you rush to You was boys to me. Oh, time Philly, back again. <laughs> Doing a little East Coast. 